Hey everyone, my name is Pritom and you're watching Tech with Pri. Welcome to my channel and I'm back with another tech video. Now, this is the second video of our new tutorial series called ServiceNow. Uh, in my last video, we have understood the very basic concept of ServiceNow and also like what are the sections, what are the topics that we are going to learn throughout this course and also what are the bonus courses I have discussed about. So if you missed that video guys, don't worry. I'm going to put the link in the description and also you can find the link here on your screen. Okay, so go and have a watch that. All right, let's see what we are going to learn in today's video. So today we are going to see what is ServiceNow in detail. Also uses of ServiceNow, different services that are available for ServiceNow. And finally, I'll talk about the ServiceNow system administrator certification course. Okay, so don't waste time. Let's get into it. So what is ServiceNow? So ServiceNow is an American company. Uh, I've talked about also in my last video that this is a company as a name of a company. So it's an American company which is located in Santa Clara, California. You can see on the left hand side uh, the picture of ServiceNow company. This is the headquarter of ServiceNow in California. Okay, so this is how it looks like. It has been established or it has been founded by Fred Ludi. Okay, the man Fred Ludi uh, on 20 on 2003. So previously ServiceNow has known as Glidesoft. Okay, on 2006 it is named as ServiceNow. All right, and it is a software as a service. So uh, in detail if you want to know what is software as a service there is a video already there in my uh, series uh, playlist called cloud computing uh, with microsoft azure there you could find the definition but in general software as a service means where the software is totally ready it's a cloud product and it's ready available for the customer it's like microsoft office so microsoft office is also an example of the software as a service product okay so service now is also a ready product so when all you need to do is buy license and then service now would be yours okay now very importantly the definition of service now you want to give in such a way so that you can understand it so it's like it's a cloud computing platform we already know now uh, it allows employees to work the way they want to not how the software detects they have to so it's a highly customizable software okay so once you get the software then you can configure it you can make it ready the way you want the way your organization or your company needs so you can configure it in your own way you can customize it in your own way right this is the best advantage of having service now so in this course throughout this course you will understand how quickly we can customize it with many different things okay so we'll talk about that let's move on and let's see what are the uses of service now so first i'll talk about the it service management so managing incident problem and changes don't worry i know many of you don't know about it but we will uh, cover it up in a separate video uh, like what are the problem changes and incident all about this it has many advanced features analytics insights also reporting stuff that impacts the speed and delivery of the it so with the help of service now the it in the it service management so they are getting a huge benefit next we have the hr management so under hr management leave management uh, timesheet management employee document management new onboarding process everything can be covered with the help of the service now Finance operation management. This is another important sector where ServiceNow can manage the kind of activities, automation, finance close, all kind of financial process. Okay. Next, we will see different services of ServiceNow. And for this, I will, I'm going to take you to the ServiceNow website uh, where I will show you a list of it. So let's go there. So right now I am in the ServiceNow website, official website. Uh, you can see servicenow.com slash products by category. So I'm going to share you this link over the description so you can find it. So let's understand what are the things ServiceNow provides. So you can see these are the things like IT service management. We have already discussed about IT operation management, HR service, workplace service delivery, customer service management, very important, field service management, app engine, DevOps, IT asset management, and there are so many. You can see there are a list of things. So you can go there and you can just click on this arrow to get more about it, understand more about it. So you can just go and read it out just to have a clear concept. Uh, also, if I just scroll down, uh, there are some solution that provides service now like the customer experience technology experience employee experience operating excellence build and automate okay again you can read out in detail about all those things and finally the industries 
the industries where service now is being used so education in, is one of the industry where service now is getting used uh, energy utilities financial services in government sector healthcare manufacturing okay retail service providers telecommunication many more so these are the areas where service now is being used so you can understand that if you have the knowledge of service now if you are a system certified administrator also so then you can have a great opportunity or great scope uh, to work work in those department being a service now consultant or a service now administrator all right so i'll again share the link so you can understand more about it all right now let's go back all right so let's move on and this is the service now system administrator so i'm going to just talk about few things about it so it's a certification from service now which you can uh, cover so which you can give it's an exam you can give and you can get a certification like this a service now system certified administrator and like i said if you complete the whole this series uh, complete the series then you can appear for it and i'll let you know also some suggestions where you can follow where you can uh, follow some things some websites i'm going to give you okay so don't worry on that so again a bit about service now so it's a cloud based platform solution deliver digital workflows that create great experience and unlock productivity for more than 6200 and enterprise like i said these number are increasing day by day so out of which uh, there are fortune 500 80% of it are fortune 500 so these are the list of the companies which are getting in high productivity uh, earning a more revenue it's a big large companies who are using service now so you can understand the importance of it right and also when you are certified as a candidate that means it has been considered that you have the knowledge uh, to you know manage the configuration implementation maintenance of the service now platform right once you have the certification so don't worry follow along with me and you will have the uh, you will be ready for the examination for sure okay now before ending this course i'm going to show you two websites okay let me go back again so this is the first website where the, uh, what is called product documentation of service now so you can get uh, it's, it's like a google of service now okay so you can get all the answers on the documentation uh, about service now what are the things you want to know maybe about incident management problem management you can get uh, look into it okay and also you can see uh, in the page you can see there are different kind of release notes and updates so don't worry uh, we are gonna learn about this releases and developer instance in the next video i know you are quite uh, waiting for hands on with the service now very soon i mean from the next video we will have all the id set up and after that we are going to learn and also practice in the service now personal developer instance you are all going to do that all right so this is the documentation uh, website documents uh, docs.servicenow.com and another one is the community.servicenow.com so this is very very strong community guys so here you can just it's just like a stack overflow so you can ask question here and there are many people who can help you with the answers so i would recommend you go to these websites and have a look on it before starting the course you should know the places where you can ask for the help okay and definitely i am here so you can ask me in the comment section any questions you have all right so this is it for today guys in the next video we will talk about the upgrades of service now what are the releases and also like the developer environment we will have our own personal developer instance okay now if you find the video helpful guys please hit the like button share with your friends and families comment also if you have any question and don't forget to hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon so that you can get notified whenever i post a new video okay see you on my next video bye bye take care Thank you.